Off the throw, oh, goes right in on net. And fast whistle there. Ooh, he's got to make the save. It's like 14, he pushed that right on the net. Cruz is They're slow getting up. up. Hate to have to grab a sub goalie at this point of the game. I think half these guys just rather grab a sub. Yeah. Just saying, now trying to connect with Teal, almost did. Ramo took a weird angle on the play. Coming in front, Whittemore steals. Momentum comes away with it in front trip. Knocked down the pass and nearly rolled into his own net. Now all the action behind the net. Six get up. No call. Tripp's gonna send it up to George Howard on the wing. George Howard collides with Wood. Pass off up the skater Whittemore, and here come the operators, and we got a high stick. Let's see what's going on here. Looks like it's just a high stick violation. The referee to this morning's game is Jim Morano down over here. And on the other side, Mark Harris. Both BBHC veterans, Johnny. Yes, yeah, many, many years. One by Corner into the side of Rigato, rather. And Rigato says, oh, they're trying to spring. See, it looks like that might have been a set play. Do they have set plays on Friday morning? They, uh, they set the alarm clock, so I know that. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much a play. Now Wood trying to play it past George Howard. Nice play with his glove. Howard says it is oh. front. Couldn't get his man. He had Whittemore and 14. He cruised into the slot. Say now gives it up. But his third giveaway this morning. And here comes Rogato. But he's been doing a lot of tape to tape passes in the long play. That's tape to tape though, it's a start. Eleven fifty, eleven forty-eight and counting. Two to two our score here in the championship game. A lot of these guys look tired right now. A little out of shape, maybe. Maybe they need a conditioning coach. I hear the New York Jets have a guy available. Bruno wins it back to Peterson. Peterson snaps it around. Jack Gavin flips it up, gets it by. Morin, Morin's gonna bump out Bruner. Borderline interference. In front of Jimmy oh, D. Now Gavin shot ball. that hit a skate. And Warren sends it out to Kramer, knocks it down to prevent the icing. This is on Warren skating with it. 11 11 to go. Second period. Peterson, Dick Gavin, all the action here at center. Finally, the puck's out of their own zone, Johnny. Gavin moving in. Off the side of the net. Jimmy D can't get it. Jimmy D always dangerous around the net. Always where he's supposed to be. So. And he flips it out. <laughs> Reed steals that one and dumps it in. Reed going for a change. See him hustling off. I'd like to see that hustle on a line change. Armand had the pass block. Now he's going to scale it in. This is Caruso. He stole the Corbican. Knocked down by Peterson right below us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't, I didn't mean it. Yeah, right. That's a Sayer on Aman. That's a mismatch, but somehow Aman comes up with a puck. Aman now with a good to do by Jimmy D. Pass hit escape. Rolls to Al Peterson. Gets it by Corbican. Knocks the man down. And he's pissed. He wants a call. He wants a call. There's no call to be had. Looks like he might have taken a little hit from Molito. Set it down for Ison. Oh, he might have a case there, Johnny. He could. He was bumped. Rick Amon leaving the ice. Yeah. Rick Amon, I don't know if it's because of the holiday season, but uh, Rick Amon was the most generous person handing out points this session with a total of uh, 18 assists to three goals. How, how many write-in assists do you think he had? Uh, well, that's a good thing. A lot of Kotex points? No, this is Rick. Rick. Oh. Well. <coughs> Long pass up now to Cormican. Cormican sends it in to Sayre, but Sayre can't get it. 
get it. It's just Talbot. Talbot in front of his own net dangerously. He's going to send it all the way up, and they're going to wave off ice, and Wood didn't even give that a try. He didn't even look at it. Now Regatta with it. Right through Melito. Now he's in front, stolen by Uretsky, and went right through him. Oh, he's going to be dreaming about that one. Right through the slot, he would have had it, he would have had a clear lane than a net. This is Wood. He calls himself the Rover. The Cormac and Big Glasgow! Cormican with a rocket up top, and it's now three to two. Wow, Johnny, you ripped that this, one. This is a, this is an amazing game. Amazing game. Mark Wood lugging the mail up over the line. <coughs> Little drop pass, and Cormican one time that, but honestly never had a chance. A lot of pepper on that shot. 14, he pushes it up. Just comes outside the zone, and now the operator's looking to strike again. And here comes Armand countering the other way. Ricky Armand over the zone. Around McCarthy moving in, center in front. Shot. Oh, what a save! 14, he had a wide open net. Looked like he shot it short side. And that's where the goal he just happened to be. <coughs> Ryan Armand now. For the operator. Stop. Keeps it in. McCarthy in deep. Spins away from his man, a little backhand flip to Armand, throws it in front, and this is Peterson now. Had to take it away by McCarthy. McCarthy had to poke off a hit stick by Rick Armand. We got the brothers Armand out there going against each other. Oh, someone was knocked down in front. We'll have to check the replay on that. Just rewind your YouTube. In front, backhand shot just goes wide by McCarthy. Down McCarthy had a poke away by Armand Caruso. Come in, shot that hit Peterson. Ow! Rick Armand scales it out, and that could be icing. The break in the action, 6.36 to go here, second period. It is 3 to 2. The operators over the milkman.